Is the steam making my skin look beautiful? <laughs> look at this madness. It's pouring down rain. My mistake. It's not pouring, it's hailing. Yeah, that's definitely hail. Ooh. That was. <laughs> Happy Tuesday, everyone. So I'm just getting off on a break for conferences and uh, it's lunchtime. And so I have leftover pizza still, but I think I'm gonna save that for dinner. So I thought I would try and make a pasta thing, but I'm not really feeling like having tomato sauce two meals in a row. So uh, I'm gonna try and experiment a little bit. This is not something I've ever made or attempted to make before, so we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna start with just the pasta because it takes a while and I know how to do that. <laughs> I'm gonna be winging it from there. What I do know is salty as the sea, I think is the how, how salty your water is supposed to be. So I'm gonna salt the water before it boils. Oh gosh, I think that's too much. That is way more salt than I usually put in, but you know, we're draining it. It's fine, right? <laughs> Yesterday for conferences, I wore like, you know, a nice sweater and slacks. And then I realized, why am I wearing slacks? Nobody can see my legs. So today I decided to wear basketball shorts. Woo! I'm like, I'm like the fashion version of a mullet. I'm business on top and party on the bottom. <laughs> so I got out the things that I have that I think I can make into a kind of a sauce. So um, I got out peas. I'm not going to use this many, but I'm going to cook them all and I'll have the rest later, I guess. Um, lemon juice, because as we've already established, I love the flavor of lemon, so I'm definitely adding that to this. Um, I have some Parmesan cheese and some heavy whipping cream, which I wasn't gonna use for this, but um, it expires on the fourth anyway, and my next click list is the third, so um, I can just replace it then. So we'll see what comes out of it. One of the great things about microwave peas is that it takes five minutes, which after the time I got everything out is basically how long the pasta has left to cook. I understand why it has that shield in the window, but I'm not exactly excited about the fact that I really cannot see what's inside and how much it's puffing up because that's the best part. Is the steam making my skin look beautiful? <laughs> okay, pasta is drained. So I'm going to start with, I think, the whipping cream. Oh, there we go. I'm not going to add too much. Ooh, that is thick. Look at how thick this is. Oh my goodness. I know it's supposed to look like that, but still. Okay. And then I think I'm going to add the cheese. Hopefully it melts evenly in there. Add it a bit at a time. Ooh, that squeaking sound. Ooh. This is like basically grown up mac and cheese. <laughs> My mom and I were talking about blue box mac and cheese today. How when I was growing up, um, every time my parents had Chinese food, because I can't eat Chinese food, um, every time my parents ordered Chinese food, it meant that I got to have blue box macaroni and cheese. And I used to live for those days. I loved having blue box mac and cheese. And then they stopped eating Chinese food. And so I grew out of my mac and cheese phase. It's kind of thickening up a little bit. Looks like a poor man's um, Alfredo. Okay, I may have made a mistake here. I think I should have melted this into the sauce, not into the pasta, because now it's all on my fork. So I added lemon juice next, and I thought I filmed it, 
but apparently I just took this 0.1 second video. So I did add lemon juice next. You just can't see it. Mm. I got my pasta facial. Now I'm getting my sugar pea facial. Mm. <laughs> oh, it looks delicious. Mm, look at that. It looks so good. Still a little bit cheesy on that bike, but we'll get it. Mm. I'm not sure how much cheese actually made it in because it looks like it's all on the bottom, but that's okay. Okay, so the fork is very cheesy, but I'm going to try the pasta anyway and see how it goes, how it tastes. Mm, that flavor of lemon, I love that. It's pretty good. It kind of tastes like Alfredo a little bit. Probably just add a little garlic powder. And it would taste like a Alfredo. It's good. I like it. 8 out of 10. <laughs> Conferences are over, so that's all for today. I think I'm going to go take a nap. Eat some more food. Maybe go to bed early. <laughs> I hope that you smile today, and I'll see you soon. Bye!